Hello YouTube, this is Tech Reviews by Greg, and today I'm going to show you an alternative home launcher for the Kindle Fire, as opposed to your standard uh, carousel and with all your different tabs and anything like that. So anyways, if you're not a big fan of that and you want a normal Android experience, then this is what I'm going to show you. So basically, let's just turn on the device, slide it over. Um, so this is your main uh, home launcher for the Kindle Fire, as you already probably know. Uh, you have this carousel here, you have your favorites, you have all these tabs at the top, search button, anything like that. If you do not want this uh, strictly Amazon style, if you want more of a natural Android tablet feel, uh, that's basically what I'm going to show you. Uh, to do that, you're going to be using a Go Launcher. Uh, there are a multitude of other uh, launchers out there that you can use, like ADW or something like that. Uh, but anyways, I'm going to show you Go Launcher. Uh, to get it on your device, you're going to have to sideload it. Uh, I'll have a link and annotation to show you how to do that from my uh, previous video. But anyways, what you're going to do is simply select uh, Go Launcher. Uh, I've already set up uh, how I want mine to look. Of course, yours will be pretty much blank, so you're going to have to set that up for yourself. But anyways, this is a much more natural uh, looking Android experience. As you can tell, you have the different home screens get all your cool transitions, put all your different apps on the home screen. You can bring up the application drawer, go through all your applications like this, and go back, you can browse the internet, everything like that. Strictly Android experience. Uh, however, when you hit the home button, you go back to this. Uh, to get rid of the main thing, you're going to go to the clear default section under the uh, Kindle's launcher. Uh, to do that, I'm going to go to your settings, you're going to go to applications, and you're going to go to all of your applications, and you're going to find the standard launcher. So let's just see if we can find that. And when we do, which is right here, uh, you're going to want to go to clear defaults, and then once you've cleared the defaults, you're not going to have a specific launcher. Uh, so it's going to bring up the option to choose from this launcher or your Go Launcher, and you're going to select Go Launcher. Uh, and then, well actually, let's just do that for you now. Clear defaults, so you hit Home. Here you have your option to choose between the two, which one you want as your permanent launcher. Uh, I personally like the this uh, style launcher, because I already have an Android phone, so might as well have the best of both worlds, I guess. But anyway, that is pretty much how... Uh, you get this uh, Android-like feel, a uh, much more natural Android-like feel as opposed to the standard Kindle Fire. Uh, anyways, uh, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed.